It's Crowley, right? So, the Hardy boys finally found me. Took you long enough. Do you have any idea how much this rug costs? This is it, right? This is what it's all about. We need to talk. What the hell is this? Do you know how deep I could have buried this thing? There's no reason you or anyone should know this even exists at all. Except that I told you. You told us. Rumors. Innuendo. Sent out on the grapevine. Why? Why tell us anything? I want you to take this thing to Lucifer and empty it into his face. Mm -hmm. Okay, and why exactly would you want the devil dead? It's called survival. But I forgot you two at best are functional morons. Yeah, you're functioning morons. Mor Lucifer isn't a demon, remember? He's an angel, an angel famous for his hatred of humankind. To him, you're just filthy bags of pus. That's the way he feels about you. What can he think about us? But he created you. To him, we're just servants, cannon fodder. If Lucifer manages to exterminate humankind, we're next. So, help me. Huh? Let's all go back to simpler, better times. Back to when we could all follow our natures. I mean, sales, damn it. So what do you say? What if I give you this thing and you go kill the devil? is a chance, would you? Thursday. Birdies tell me he has an appointment in Carthage, Missouri. Great. Thanks. Oh, yeah, right. You probably need some more ammunition. Uh, excuse me for asking, but aren't you kind of signing your own death warrant? I mean, what happens to you if we go up against the devil and lose? Number one, he's going to wipe us all out anyway. Two, after you leave here, I go on an extended vacation to all points nowhere. And three, how about you don't miss, okay? 